Todd, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk. Uh, we're going to be reviewing Medieval Madness today by Chicago Gaming Company. It's a remake. Beautiful table. I'm highly impressed with Chicago Gaming. Uh, that said, please look for our review underneath the description of our YouTube video, as well as like and follow us on our social media formats, Arcade and Pinball Talk, and our Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, as well as YouTube. If you like arcade, if you like pinball, if you like pinball in general, across the board, that's our format. That's all we do is talk pinball here at Arcade and Pinball Talk. Join our family. Click subscribe. Thank you again for watching. Let's get this review underway, shall we? First things first, man, these Chicago gaming games, never played them before in my entire life. And I made the trek up to Indianapolis, which was a three hour drive for me, to be able to finally play some Jersey Jacks and some Chicago games, just so I knew what I was talking about. When I respond and talk in all of my formats from in the news and or reviews. And I'm glad I did. Chicago Gaming has a lot of good stuff going on. As you just saw, that left ramp right there exits have a trail left in lane. Flipper gap is actually a little wider on this. You get an in lane to the left and right, exit lane to the left and the right. Artwork is actually just what you would expect from Medieval Man. It's nothing's really different, just the way that it is presented. So it's what you would expect. It's Medieval Man, it's just redone. Music's there, exactly the same. The table layout is pretty much identical. You know, and like Medieval Madness, I played this on every single format. The old Medieval Madness. I played the virtual Medieval Madness on FX3. I played it on BP. I played it on Future Pinball. So I played this, I, I played this and reviewed it right now at this moment doing this one I've reviewed this probably six times right now in every format available and what I'll tell you is uh, you know the original is good what I will tell you is this Chicago gaming version is stunning I mean the back glass or trans light uh, the LCD DMD it just looks good it's just as hard to moderate to light high difficulty on medieval madness as you saw with the gate being open you know I triggered the gate went back there blow up the castle so blew up the castle, got two million points there. Very stacked to the inside of this table. So you got ramps to the left and right. You have your ball lock to the, the right of your left uh, ramp. You have the gate, which is a trawl, which the ball goes into right there and triggers the gate. You also have a little ball lock slash little kick out to the right of that. There's your ball lock there, so that should be ball lock number three. I'm as, oh, number one right now. So I got the castle, hopefully, oh. Anyway, you got your pop bumpers and columns to the back right. You know, lane coming around the right side, coming down to some uh, some targets there too. So, all in all, great game. I mean, looks beautiful, plays well, sounds good, sound bites, theme, artwork, everything is there. Play this, buy it, period. Awesome. Everyone will tell you the same thing, trust me. Uh, anyway, please look for a review. Our full review will be written out underneath the description of our video on desktop. We'll say show more underneath the video. On mobile, there's going to be a little triangle there in the headline. Click it, and it will drop down, and that way you can see our metrics and what we wrote out. Uh, all in all, play it, buy it. Anyway, please click subscribe. Thank you again for watching today. Till next time.